Hello. Hi. Is it audible now? Hi. Uh, hello. Hello. Great. I think it's audible. OK, great. I'm, I'm really sorry uh, for the goof up. Uh, so basically, this is the first time we are using a new tool. Uh, so apologies for that. And uh, yeah, with that, let's let's get started. Hello, everyone, and uh, happy to greet you all uh, once again after a, a long time. And good morning, good evening, and uh, good afternoon to whichever part of the uh, globe you are. And a very warm welcome to each one of you for the Deep Learning Bootcamp graduation ceremony. Uh, as you all know, we all as you all know, we all work together as a community and help each other as a community. So we take this opportunity to uh, celebrate together as well, uh, to recognize the efforts of uh, speakers, coaches, and uh, learners alike. And uh, for those unattended, this is the first time uh, we are doing a, a YouTube live. So I'll also, to keep it uh, relevant for everyone, I'll also give a bit more context about DeFi and uh, a bit more context about uh, what we are trying to do at DeFi. So, um, and also, uh, for those on the LinkedIn, so we recently conducted a deep learning boot camp filled with learners from various backgrounds, uh, ranging from arts, accounts, engineering, HR, data scientists, and software engineers. And also at the same time, we have seen people from all walks of life, from high school students to 60 plus years of uh, 60 plus years uh, old entrepreneurs and leaders, et cetera. And, uh, with that, let me give you all a bit more context about what DeFi is and what we intend to do. Uh, for those unattended, DeFi is a data science community that started its journey with a vision to build data culture and democratize a data science learning. I think it's um, so let me just put up this slide as well for everyone. So this is the vision that which we started with and uh, yeah, and the community currently comprises of uh, passionate data scientists and data science enthusiasts uh, who enjoy learning, sharing knowledge, and love giving back to the community. So uh, also, Itlana, uh, I believe you are at the other end. And if, if something goes wrong, just give me a heads up. OK. And uh, yeah, and, and with that, like you know, we took our very first step by launching a five-week data science boot camp. I think I've uh, discussed that here where like, you know, we launched it back in uh, May 25th, uh, 2020 and what started as a small initiative garnered 3000 uh, attention of 3500 plus learners across uh, 70 plus uh, countries and was conducted in collaboration with uh, a lot of domain experts from the industry and academia uh, consisting of uh, 15 plus speakers and 50 plus coaches. So this was back in uh, May 2020. And then after that, we launched our platform in uh, July 2020, where uh, the learners on the platform and in the community can learn data science problem solving through boot camps, micro courses, uh, data thons, basically the data science challenges, uh, practice and discussion forums. And deep learning boot camp, uh, for which like you know, we are doing the graduation ceremony right now, is our second boot camp. And we are looking forward to coming up with more such initiatives. Uh, which we which would create a much bigger impact that would contribute directly to our vision. And uh, with that, let me get started with the presentation ceremony. And also, firstly, first off, my heartfelt uh, congratulations to those uh, who have successfully completed uh, the boot camp. And for those who couldn't, uh, like, you know, we are here to back. Uh, basically, the content is available out there on DeFi.tech. We have added each and every uh, content that is uh, put up in the boot camp out here. You can find it on uh, getting started with deep, uh, deep learning. So you'll be able to find the content here. So you can go there, learn, and uh, and basically apply the concepts that you learn uh, wherever you are. And um, yeah, and, and to be honest, uh, le let me, like, you know, I need to confess this. It's, it's not easy for each and every learner out there, right, to spend those three, four weeks 
while carrying out their routine activities and also during these unprecedented times it's it's not easy to give that time and effort to be able to make things happen or achieve it or put that continuous effort to, in order to uh, succeed in the overall learning journey process so uh, kudos to each one of them uh, who have successfully completed it and at the same time i have personally seen a lot of uh, learners running into gpu uh, gpu issues i mean like you know lack of uh, memory or probably their machines are not working uh, well or they they ran into several errors but the only thing that they kept doing is they kept moving they kept learning they didn't give up so that's what uh, made them uh, stand out and in fact like you know that was very inspiring for us too because it it pushed our limits to deliver the best every day and uh, uh, we are very happy to see the way learners were able to get introduced to the field and and together as a community we have achieved this it's it's not just uh, the learner or the coaches or it, it's it's a collaborative effort uh, i think uh, we are very happy with that and at the same time many uh, are uh, heartfelt gratitude and uh, many thanks to all the coaches and speakers for making this happen um so with that let me start off with uh, some of the graduation cards okay i believe everything is going on well out there um okay i can already see that uh, some of them asking for and lp sessions and a few others yes we will surely come up with more such sessions uh, thanks thanks for that and uh, yeah okay great i hope you are able to see this yeah and also during this just to give everyone some understanding of it like you know we'll walk over through some of the graduation cards uh, some of the learnings that uh, the learners have shared and meanwhile i mean like in between we will also talk uh, about some of our speakers and uh, the messages that they have for you okay we will do that uh, one by one and first off uh, like you know we have nasreen here she's from mumbai she's uh, she's a programmer and uh, let me tell you uh, she has shared his own uh, her own experience basically she dreamed to build a robot back in her school and she has done her bachelor's in home science back in 2000 and uh, started learning to code from there on and now she aspires to become an ai engineer it's it's truly inspiring to see the kind of grit and cautious effort that she has been making over time and i'm i'm confident she will achieve her goals uh, she she is uh, this is the second boot camp for her with us and uh, it's it's very inspirational to meet such kind of individuals and learn from their experiences through this uh, uh, boot camp and at the same time next we have uh, shantnil uh, he is currently pursuing his masters in uh, mcgill university uh, he's another guy i'm mean, like you know very enthusiastic in the community and uh, he has been uh, uh, sharing a lot of knowledge that he has been gaining over time on his uh, linkedin profile and it's it's free to watch uh, him do that uh, we have uh, lekura you know uh, from nigeria his uh, data science trainee and uh, the the one of the important learnings that he had during this journey is uh, he learned not to memorize code and he has shared his own uh, experience out here we will also share these graduation cards in a while once the ceremony is done and uh, we have uh, yogesh kumar from kolkata he is a senior manager at uh, railtel corporation and he has spoken about his own experience at the same time uh, he was uh, thanking his friend uh, mr pra uh, pratik uh, who has introduced him to the boot camp and uh, we have uh, lakshesha uh, he he explains that like you know he has ran into several troubles but he kept moving and at the same time he is talking about uh, dipanjan who is an inspiration for him for several years and uh, thanks thanks uh, lakshay for sharing your journey and uh, thanks to the panel for inspiring not just you but uh, many other learners out there and uh, yeah and we have uh, pratik srivastav he's again like you know another very proactive in the community and uh, uh, he mentions about uh, his own experience and he apologizes to the mentors for constant poke okay don't don't be apologetic about it uh, it's it's fine to get into troubles and like you know sort them out and uh, thanks uh, pratik so we have uh, kanmani subramanian 
and again like you know she's uh, sharing her own experience and uh, uh, glad to know uh, about her inspiring journey and glad to know that we were a part of your journey in achieving your own goals uh, uh, kanmani uh, just to yeah and we have uh, anthony amalraj here uh, he tack he talks about his passion and drive for deep learning and took a uh, first step by successfully changing his dreams by learning deep learning uh, through the boot camp and we have anga ankush so she she is uh, talking about her own experience from the community she emphasizes on the uh, like you know basically the community learning aspects uh, she is currently pursuing his her masters in uh, uh, statistics and we have uh, kartik from dallas he is a lead data science uh, he is a lead analyst data science at enforces and uh, i think he's he's also one uh, he's he has stopped uh, one of our assignments i think assignment 2 in the intermediate category and uh, uh, his notebook was was really amazing to read i think probably like you know once you're done with the uh, with the ceremony you can probably uh, look at it uh, it's it's a very nice notebook that he has written and i think uh, everyone can learn a lot from that we have anna emmanuel from kochi india Uh, she is currently a computer science uh, student at government model engineering college and we have uh, gursimer i think uh, for gursimer this is the second boot camp again uh, he has done uh, uh, previously the data science boot camp and then this is his uh, second journey and at this time he has picked up very well and his uh, notebook stood as uh, one of the his uh, we uh, like you know his notebook was featured among uh, uh, the top notebooks out there and uh, we have anushka dwivedi as well uh, she is currently pursuing her computer science engineering bachelor's at indore institute of science and technology and she she talks about her own uh, experience about how intuitive it is and uh, others and we have anil vignesh again his uh, he is working as a data analyst at uh, nelson so he shares his experience about the course uh, saying that it's not spoon fed nor was hard to pursue at the same time uh, i need to mention something else about anil i think uh, he also was in uh, top 10 in the intermediate category if i'm not wrong and uh, again like you know he has he has put in a lot of effort in terms of uh, reaching where he is uh, in in with regards to the boot camp we have uh, vishal Borana again he's a software developer from uh Enforces so he was able to strengthen his fu fundamentals so one thing that we can see over uh, this exercise right i think everyone was able to either uh, gain some knowledge or like you know probably like you know strengthening their fundamentals or learning from the community all they have been doing is they kept moving and they were able to apply the process well Uh, with grit and with passion perseverance and that's what took them uh, what they are and rightly like you know we have mentioned here you dreamed you believed and you achieved and with that i'll probably take a small break out here and then uh, uh, i'll i'll probably like you know show a small video which was shared by dipanjan so for those unattended uh, dipanjan is is a lead a lead data scientist at applied materials and uh, he's also just give me I'm really sorry. Let me just play the video for all of you here. He has a very uh, motivating message for the entire community out there. And uh, just give me one second. Itlana, can you hear me and can you unmute yourself? If if there is anything, you can probably talk to me directly. And uh, yeah. okay great uh, so with that like you know, i would want to share the message that uh, dipanjan has for each one of us so for those unattended dipanjan is the data science lead at uh, uh, applied materials and he's also a, a google developer expert he's an author and a mentor as well and 
uh, he's one of the best. He's the best in the industry right now and was recently uh, featured as a top 10 data scientist in India. And uh, his contributions to the community are nothing but incredible. I mean, he, he keeps sharing knowledge despite being extremely occupied with a lot of engagements out there. Uh, he takes time out to teach and share his knowledge and create an impact in the community. And then he's an inspiration for many learners out there, not just in the, in the community, but also outside the community. I mean, outside the uh, DeFi community, I mean, in, in, uh, in the broader sense, I mean, uh, the data science community. And let's see what uh, the Panjan has to share for each one of you out there. Thanks, thanks a lot, uh, Dipanjan, for uh, motivational. I mean, I think uh, that's that's very relevant, and I think we should keep moving and uh, we should keep exploring. And and this this boot camp is just a basis, and I think uh, sky is the limit to learn and apply uh, concepts and probably like you know, learn more. I would also strongly recommend you to follow him uh, because he keeps uh, delivering some amazing sessions. So probably like you know you can attend uh, his future sessions too. Okay, I'm really sorry. I think uh, the Pundin's audio was not audible. Uh, let me share it again. Everyone, DJ here. Uh, I would like to thank DJ here. Everyone, DJ here. Uh, I would like to thank uh, DeFi for such a wonderful initiative and uh, big congratulations to each and every one of you for not only just taking this uh, deep learning bootcamp, but sticking it out till the very end. I know current times are trying, it's hard, but <clears throat> the fact that you folks have been investing time in learning really shows uh, how great that is. And uh, I would like to say that uh, continue learning, never give up on uh, learning new things, staying up to date on the latest trends. Uh, technology and being on top of things because that is how you continue growing, evolving and getting better over time. So once again, uh, big congratulations and have a great graduation ceremony. Thanks. Thanks a lot, uh, Dipanjan. I hope uh, it was audible to everyone and I'm really sorry for the inconvenience caused. And uh, yeah, with that, uh, let's go to the next learner's card. So we have uh, Meena uh, Manogran now. And she expresses that like, you know, this is the first boot camp uh, that she has uh, participated in. And uh, she talks about her own experience. And uh, just let me tell you, like, you know, she has been putting efforts consistently. Okay. She didn't just stop with the boot camp. I mean, she uh, enthusiastically participates in, in most of the data cons that we host. And uh, that technically keeps everyone abreast of uh, what they I mean what they have they can basically potentially put their skills to test at the same time uh, while participating in these uh, data thons or probably working on different projects you will also be able to keep yourself abreast with the uh, latest uh, updates or like you know latest uh, technologies out there or the algorithms whatever it is I think uh, that that keeps you on your toes as uh, the Panjan just mentioned and uh, yeah, and we have uh, Vineet out here. 
uh, from New Delhi. He's a computer science engineering student from Bennett University. He talks about how it boosted his confidence and uh, how he was able to practically implement things. And uh, yeah, thanks, uh, Vineet, for sharing your experience. And we have uh, Sai Bhargava Raja. Uh, he's an automation developer at Ericsson. Uh, thanks, uh, Bhargava, for sharing your experience. And uh, we are very pleased to know your experience. And at the same time, uh, uh, and next we have uh, Juhi Arora. And, and uh, she's from Gurgaon. She has, uh, she's currently doing uh, her master's in uh, informatics from in uh, Institute of Informatics and Communication, Delhi University. Next, we have uh, Aishwarya Das from uh, United States of America. He's a data scientist at IBM. Uh, so he, he talks about his experience and he's looking forward to uh, using his acquired skills at work very soon. And uh, previously he has uh, had some academic experience with deep learning and uh, this bootcamp has given him the practical experience and it's very interesting to learn that like you know, he'll be soon implementing what he has learned um, we have mud uh, midun from again like you know he's doing his uh, bachelor's in electronics and communication from college of engineering trivandrum so and next is we have uh, urmisha from rajkot gujarat she's a freelancer and uh, here like you know she's talking about uh, her experience of uh, it being inspiring and to the point. Uh, and we have uh, Dr. Rubel Merin Lindsay. She's an independent researcher from India. And uh, yeah, I mean, again, uh, she's thanking uh, the speakers uh, out there for being so inspirational. Thanks, thanks again to all the speakers out there for the amazing uh, job that you have done. And uh, we have uh, Satya Nandana. Uh, he's currently pursuing his bachelor's in uh, production engineering at uh, PSG College of Technology. We have Chirag Ganguly. I think this is again uh, his second bootcamp uh, journey with us. Uh, thanks, uh, Chirag, for again joining in and uh, being able to achieve this. Uh, again, we have uh, Dennis from Br Brazil. He's uh, currently pursuing his bachelor's in uh, computer science engineering from federal university of para uh, we also have an uh, in interesting message from dennis as well uh, a video message probably i'll uh, if we get time i'll play it at the end or i'll, I'll share it with the community later uh, thanks uh, dennis for sharing your experience and we have uh, niveta b uh, niveta barasubraman uh, she's a software engineering at hsbc again she's it is her uh, second bootcamp experience for uh, with us and uh, she, she, again, like, you know, constantly puts efforts in terms of uh, participating in a lot of things or keeping abreast uh, with uh, the latest uh, happenings out there in the industry. So, yeah. And we have uh, another interesting person out here. We have Philip from uh, Jerusalem, Israel. Uh, he's a data scientist. And also uh, he is maintaining a community called as uh, uh, Data Science Much Needed on Quora, which has uh, over 53K followers. I think that's amazing. I mean, uh, again, like, you know, we have another member who is who himself is contributing back to the community through his uh, uh, through his blog on Medium and others. Uh, very inspiring to see these kind of people out there in the community. Uh, thanks, uh, Philip, for your inspiring message. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm sure like, you know, you'll do well with uh, uh, data science much needed and uh, grow it further. And we have Ayub from uh, Morocco. He's uh, currently a PhD researcher and a data scientist at University City Mohammed uh, Ben. And he's someone again, like you know, who has proactively come forward to uh, do the translations in uh, French and Arabic, uh, which is very motivating. Thanks, thanks a lot, uh, Ayub, for that. And uh, keep learning and keep contributing and keep giving back to the community. Thanks. We have uh, Pinky Chow Chowdhury from India. She is uh, pursuing her bachelor's in information uh, information technology from uh, Gujarat the Technical University. Uh, she talks about her own experience out here. Um, and she 
and in her opinion, uh, the final project was the best part of the boot camp, uh, as she got to implement a lot of things that she has learned. Uh, yeah, thanks, thanks, Minky, for uh, sharing your journey. And we have uh, Myra from Philippines. She's a lead business analyst from Intercontinental Hotels Group, and uh, she has uh, an. She is uh, basically like you know, sharing her own experience out here. And with that, like you know, I'll probably take a short uh, break out here, and uh, I'll probably share a message that we have uh, from uh, Julian. OK, I'm really sorry. Um, Itlana, can you unmute yourself and? Uh... Yeah, yeah, I'm here. If you can hear me. Yeah, great, great. You're, you're, you're audible. And if there is anything, just uh, pause me. And sure, sure. Uh, yeah, great. Thanks. Thanks a lot for that. And uh... okay, that let me share a message that we have from uh, Julian. Unfortunately, uh, Julian is unable to join today. However, uh, he has a very good message for all of us. Uh, he says uh, he greets everyone with uh, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. And uh, it's a pleasure to be with you. Yes, he is omnipresent. He is there out there on uh, YouTube Live. Uh, it's a pleasure to be with you today, celebrating success in a new professional stage in your careers. DeFi's bootcamp has been a unique learning opportunity for everyone. For an, from an academic perspective, we have fulfilled the great goal of imparting content like few others, offering a complete and updated program. The bootcamp showed us that a cause can be powerful enough to unite people who speak different languages and different cultures, who are miles away but are connected to the learning mission and contributing to each other because someone's enthusiasm can be inspiring. Yes, true, I mean, uh, it, it was an honor to be, to be a part of an initiative that managed to transcend virtual barriers, reaching more than 3,000 people, not only with knowledge, but with an opportunity to grow. Witn witnessing your progress makes me ratify that our work and teaching effort are worth it, because you giving meaning to every effort we make to deliver the best we have, not only as professionals, but as people. Thanks to each one of you, mentors, coaches, learners, and DeFi members for fulfilling our lives with pride, satisfaction. You have been an inspiration to me. Special thanks to Gunika, Manish, Arib, Itlana, Nasreen, Gaurab, Joanna, who, all, who have put all their efforts to give us all their love and work in flavor of uh, in favor of uh, wor world education and of course our eternal thanks to chanukya for making this learning dream an extraordinary reality uh, let this be the beginning of a path to travel together from now on i wish you the greatest success on this beautiful journey so this is the inspiring uh, message we have out there i hope uh, julian uh, you are uh, hearing us out Hello. Uh, Itlana, I think uh, uh, I just saw that uh, there is no audio for Ahmed. I am active on YouTube. I can hear it. OK, great, great, perfect. I don't know if uh, it's how much internet. Um, no problem. Yeah, maybe. Uh, also, we have uh, Joinal joining us and also Raviraj. Uh, maybe uh, Joinal or Raviraj, who wants to go first to share your experiences? Uh, Raviraj, you want to go first? Okay, I can go first. Okay, great. Yeah. Yeah. 
so first of all i want to congratulate d5 for successfully completing this uh, boot camp like i saw a lot of enthusiast enthusiastic learners and then like uh, i i see the struggles and all like up very close so i'm glad that most of you were able to complete the boot camp successfully and then uh, i'm also hopeful that you have learned a lot in the journey and uh, a, a big shout shout out to chanukya and uh, other defi team for making this platform freely available for all the learners it's a great, uh, it's a great thing to do in the current uh, times and uh, yeah i yeah thanks uh, anything so, else yeah, yeah yeah go ahead go ahead go ahead ravi yeah yeah so i would like to add one more thing like just uh, don't stop learning guys so keep learning and then like uh, there, there's no end to it as you keep learning like uh, first you started with basic machine learning and then like now you're able to build awesome image classifiers and then like now you went to uh, learn transfer learning now you can just get into nlp or any other uh, data science applications and then like just don't stop learning keep doing projects and uh, yeah just follow um, follow other uh, github repositories and then like uh, just um, take inspiration from them and then like try to uh, do some awesome projects and build a great portfolio that's it chanak great great thanks thanks a lot uh, ravi for the inspiring message and uh, thanks a lot for joining in uh, despite having a hectic schedule out there and uh, I'll, i'll definitely connect you back to you uh, soon and yeah joinal uh, we can already hear you out please go ahead yeah hey chanakya thank you for uh, yeah i like to first thank the defi community for having at least me and, and all the speakers here to to share at least the little that we know uh, with the with all the learners and what fascinates me most is uh, when i get random messages in linkedin uh, where where people come and say hey, i attended this session uh, in in uh, defi and, and i li- i like something and and i also like when people come back with questions so that is that is the mo- most interesting part i had not been very uh, active in slack but but uh, like whenever i get time i i come to slack and try to answer questions but uh, but uh, there are a lot of students who come to linkedin directly and and ask question that is what i encourage everyone to do because most of us at least the at least the speakers are not very active on on um, slack because of our other commitments uh but yeah but also uh, the kind of feedback that i have been seeing in in linkedin right people are posting that hey i learned uh, this new thing from uh, defi and then and then aced a hackathon right that is very inspiring to see that what we are all also like what we and and defi are trying to do we are at least at least making an impact in in uh, people's life and right. also uh, and also this is just a start for everyone uh, i would encourage everyone to experiment more uh, because i think what we have done is 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 it just showed you the path and now we all can help each other and and achieve what we want totally thanks thanks it on uh, joinal it's it's uh, totally aligned on that and uh, Uh, looking forward uh, i'm sure like you know learners will uh, pick things from here on uh, with the advices that you ravi raj and uh, dipanjan gave uh, i'm sure i mean like you know this is just the beginning and we have a lot more to achieve and uh, a lot more to do because uh, the boot camp entire idea is to help people get started it is it doesn't make you a master of it it, it helps you get started and it's the ideal launch pad and from there on sky is the limit you just keep moving keep learning Uh, a lot more about the subject and uh, go there dive deep okay uh, thanks and and for those uh, unattended right uh, so joinal uh, he is working as a data scientist at uh, hello doc uh, he's again a uh, author speaker and mentor he keeps contributing to the community this is the uh, second boot camp where uh, he has uh, delivered session uh, for defi otherwise like you know he keeps uh, himself engaged with other uh like you know other sessions and other things and also like you know he helped us introduce to the panjan and thanks thanks a lot uh, for that uh, join uh, your contributions have, have been 
very in i mean like you know they are uh, huge and thanks thanks eton for everything and at the same time raviraj right uh, raviraj uh, I, i didn't introduce uh, all of you but like you know for those i'm sure like you know most of you know him but for those uh, unattended he's currently working as a software engineer uh, at uh, scala ai and he's a data science geek he always uh, tries to stay on top of uh, what's happening out there in the industry and the boot camp would not be the same without him he was there all throughout and uh, our gratitude and many thanks to all the valuable contributions he has made in making it happen and i have seen him uh, very closely on how he has worked hard uh, to get the things right for his uh, session i treating it over and over again and uh, it was his first ever session uh, first guest lecture out there and and i believe like you know he has done an amazing job and we can also see the appreciations that were pouring in on the on the session as well thanks thanks it on uh, ravi and thanks it on uh, joinal uh, both of us for joining in and uh, have a have a great day yeah great evening sorry yeah and with that uh, let's go to the next uh, set of uh, sessions uh, okay ne next set of uh, learners learner cards i think uh, we already have spoken about myra uh, she's uh, from philippines and uh, she's a lead business analyst at intercontinental hotels group she has uh, shared about her uh, learning experience and uh, we have uh, mariam bello from nigeria she's a graduate student from university of lagos okay and uh, here she has uh, shared her own experience at the same time let me tell uh, a little more about uh, mariam she has uh, she has also written amazing notebook i believe and uh, uh, her notebook got featured in the best projects out there uh, thanks thanks a lot uh, mariam for sharing your journey and uh, uh, being proactive in the community keep learning and uh, enjoy what you're doing uh, we have selvan from uh, chennai uh, he is a programmer at uh, cloud technology uh, he's a cloud technology architect at cognizant again for selvan i believe this is the second boot camp uh, for him his his again like you know he was proactive last time and again uh, he's back here um we have uh, daniel from bogota uh, colombia he's a statistician and uh, he has uh, his own experiences to share about uh, the community the power of community learning and others and we have uh, jesters from lagos nigeria he is a freelance uh, data science data analyst and uh, we have uh, again we have olero dio from lagos nigeria his uh, his generalist is into management consulting business development and he is from nigeria uh, again he is another amazing guy who has been uh, uh, like you know continuing to learn uh, Uh, about data science deep learning and other technologies and he's also trying to contribute uh, his bit to the community by uh, doing the translations and others thanks uh, dio for everything and um, uh, we have uh, nikhil jain uh, from noida he's a quality assurance analyst i think just before our call i was just seeing his uh, post on uh, slack he has started his own uh, youtube channel to spread and share uh, knowledge uh, very good to see you uh again like you know give it, give back to the community by sharing your own knowledge uh, all the best with that nikhil and uh, we have uh, we have sultan mohiddin from chennai he is a computer science uh, student and uh, he is sharing his his situation in this pandemic situation uh, this boot camp gave me a wonderful experience and uh, he's uh, basically sharing his own experience and uh, how he has uh, achieved things uh, we have uh, sai prashant uh, from uh, aswaru peta he's doing his computer science engineering at bml uh, munjal university and we have uh, jairam choudhury uh, he's working as a data analyst at cognizant technology solutions uh, jairam is again like you know his he's very proactive in all the live sessions and uh, if he doesn't understand something he keeps asking questions and he's very proactive that way he's inquisitive 
and tries to get things right and and at the same time i have also seen, seen one of his uh, medium articles uh, he tries to uh, share what he has learned which is very good i think you should continue doing that uh, jayram congrats and uh, great effort on that and we have uh, sriram radhakrishnan from chennai he's a project associate uh, at ms uh, swaminathan research uh, foundation and uh, we have uh, we have lindro benetton from argentina uh, he's founder and ceo at benetton.io uh, again like you know he's sharing his uh, experience about the intensity and the the contents that are there on the platform thanks thanks a lot uh, benetton for sharing your experience and we have uh, lakshman raj uh, from karaikudi he is currently pursuing his uh, bachelor's in electronics and instrumentation from congo engineering college and um, yeah he is sharing his own experiences out here so and uh, we have uh, kritika devi chandran from chennai india uh, she is uh, doing pursuing her bachelor's in, in mathematics from vaishnavi college uh, for women and uh, we have uh, jasroop singh chadda uh, from delhi he is uh, pursuing his uh, bachelor's in computer science engineering uh, velour institute of technology bhopal we have a, a, a interesting story a story to share out here i think jasroop is uh, very very hard working he is very diligent when it comes to submitting the assignments or whatever it is uh, he was also a little upset when he learned that uh, he couldn't get the certificate of excellence because last time he missed it narrowly and uh, this time also he missed it narrowly let me uh, tell and confess uh, to everyone i think uh, the segregation or like you know the top notebooks everything yes i mean like you know there is a bit of uh, segregation out there uh, but the entire exercise of conducting this kind of boot camps right we would want to spread the knowledge and uh, at the same time like you know, we would want people to absorb the knowledge and apply them okay as long as you're learning it's it's very good enough okay yes i mean like you know certificates and uh, other things they help to some extent but you should also prove them when you are if i have to put it in context with an interview you have to prove them during the interview process on how well you have learned and how well you can apply given a problem okay i think learning is the biggest asset that you would achieve out of this exercise so if you have learned something be proud of it pat your back, uh, pat yourself at your back and uh, move on okay don't really uh, worry or like you know keep yourself worried about uh, these minor things like i mean like you know if you have i mean uh, i saw him being upset but now he's fine so congrats uh, just roop on that and uh, keep moving i'm sure like you know you can achieve uh, bigger things uh, going forward so we have uh, diana atif george from uh, egypt she's a machine learning researcher and uh, yeah i mean she is sharing her own experience about the unique content and effort uh, that she has experienced throughout the whole journey and we have aslam salim from india uh, he's currently pursuing her uh, his bachelor's in uh, uh, computer science engineering at rajiv gandhi institute of technology kotham and uh, we have uh, aditya botra so uh, he i mean he's a systems engineer at infosys and he's from uh, delhi india uh, so he he's talking about uh, his own experience about uh, how he was able to clarify doubts and uh, how the slides and other things helped during his uh, journey and we have uh, satish kumar from trichinapalli uh, tamil nadu is uh, currently pursuing his uh, bachelor's in uh, production engineering uh, from psg college of uh, technology i love the innovative uh, and community learning part of defi yes i mean like you know everyone loves the community learning part i think uh, uh, thanks thanks a lot uh, for emphasizing on that uh, satish and uh, we have uh, srijit from uh, trivandrum india uh he is currently pursuing his bachelor's in uh, electronics and uh, uh communications engineering from college of engineering trivandrum uh the and he is sharing his own uh, experience out here 
we have uh, Puneet Tiwari from Reva. Uh, he's pursuing his bachelor's in computer science from uh, VIT, Bhopal. We have uh, Garima Makhar from uh, Gurgaon. She's a consultant. And uh, we have uh, Vijay Kesavan from Singapore. He's uh, a VP. Uh, we, he's a vice president digital solutions at uh, Shah Jal, uh, University of Science and Technology. Uh, I think we should talk uh, a little bit about uh, uh, Vijay. I mean, uh, uh, Vijay, I think uh, he's one of those uh, leaders in the industry, like, you know, who, is, uh, who has uh, probably, like, you know, worked for some of the Fortune 500 companies and consulted for them. And uh, his thirst for learning new technologies are something that is inspiration for a younger generation or for anyone for that matter. Okay, she, so here uh, he's talking about his own experience out there. Uh, basically, he learned about AI back in his bachelor's in 90s and 95s or so. And then uh, again, like, you know, he got an opportunity to revisit them and understand uh, the application aspects of it. And uh, it's it's very inspiring to know his journey and like you know his never-ending attitude to learn something new, and keep abreast about uh, the latest technologies, uh, which is very inspiring. Thanks, thanks a lot, sir, for uh, sharing your journey. And um, we have uh, Mirza Nihal Baig uh, from Bangladesh. He's uh, currently pursuing his uh, bachelor's in uh, computer science and engineering uh, from Punjab University. Uh, meanwhile, let me check out YouTube. Okay, uh, I think we have, uh, yeah, we have few more slides out there. Uh, we are pretty much done. And we have uh, Babia Bansal, uh, who's pursuing her master's in uh, statistics. And she's, she has also worked at UST Global, I believe. Uh, and we have uh, Deepa Sarojan. Uh, again, like, you know, it is her second boot camp out here. Thanks, uh, Deepa, for joining in again and like, you know, making it happen. And uh, she's working right now as a senior uh, system analyst at, uh, uh, yeah. And she's from Mangaluru University. And we have uh, Roshan Kumar G from Mangalore. He's currently pursuing his uh, master's in uh, statistics. So he has uh, basically explained about his own uh, learning journey. And we have Kavya uh, from Kochi, and uh, she's currently pursuing her bachelor's in computer science. And we have uh, Ahmad Alam uh, from, uh, he's from France and he's a telecom engineer at uh, HDFC Mutual Fund. Uh, I think uh, Ahmad, for Ahmad, this is the second boot camp, and uh, he has a uh, very, very inspiring story. I, I can, I mean, like, you know, his, his story is very inspiring to me. Uh, I met him, I spoke to him during the first boot camp where he's going through a lot in his, uh, in his own uh, personal life where, like, you know, he was affected with the pandemic, where his family members uh, were affected with the pandemic, but still, uh, I mean, like, you know, he took out some time to learn because uh, he saw something in it and like, you know, probably to keep uh, himself off for a while, like, you know, he started uh, coming onto the platform and uh, start to started to code and probably like, you know, do some assignments. And uh, I hope everything is fine now. And like, you know, I believe everything has been sorted, but uh, it's, it's very inspirational wherein uh, he kept, I mean, it's not just about one experience, but uh, I think after that, uh, he has picked things up and like, you know, the way uh, he applies himself in learning the subject or applying it and over and over uh, on beat on Kaggle or beat in his own assignments out there in, in uh, whatever we have done. It's it's very inspiring again uh, with the kind of, uh, again, he's, he's working full time out there. Okay, so to take out time from his own work and then applying what are being taught out here is is truly commendable. And thanks, thanks a lot, uh, Ahmad, for being such an inspiration and uh, for putting all the efforts. And uh, I mean, you truly inspired me and I'm sure like, you know, we will definitely bring out your story and it will be inspirational for many others out there who are struggling with whatever things that they are doing uh, in their own uh, journeys. And we have uh, Deep Ch Chatterjee. Uh, he's from Pune. Uh, he's a financial advisor. Uh, 
and uh, he's from CCMB, Center for Cellular and Molecular Biology. And um, we have uh, Johnny from Hyderabad. He's a postdoc re researcher. So uh, he's again like you know for Johnny, this is the second boot uh, second uh, boot camp uh, learning experience. And uh, as we can see, he's looking forward to uh, analyzing biomedical data uh, in the area of research uh, after this. Um, that's that's truly commendable, Johnny. And uh, we are looking forward to seeing you explore this potential and probably like you know apply in real life and uh, probably publish some research papers as well, which are, which are in line to your objectives. Thanks, Alan, uh, for sharing your experience. And with that, I'll uh, also maybe uh, if everyone is missing out, um, uh, probably like you know there is one person who is missing out there that is uh, Gunika uh, in the session. So usually she she has always been proactive and being there right at the front in terms of uh, conducting or moderating the sessions. Uh, so today she's not there because um, she has her exams going on and uh, tomorrow she has some important exam. However, we have a, a small a video message uh, from Hi, her. Man. Congratulations. Okay, I hope, uh, let's see like, you know, what she has to share with us. Hi everyone, congratulations. It's definitely not easy to juggle with multiple things at a time, but you all managed to pull it off so well. I'm also looking forward to see the implementations of all the things you learn in the bootcamp into exciting new projects. Also, we saw a lot of people from the data science bootcamp participating in the deep learning bootcamp. And I would love to see new people sticking around with us throughout our new ventures. All the best. Bye-bye. Thanks. Thanks a lot, uh, Gunika, for sharing uh, the message. And uh, yeah, and by being omnipresent. Thanks, Adan, for that. And uh, with that, I think uh, we are pretty much uh, done with it. But we have a few more messages to share. I have a small message uh, from Pranjil, who is uh, another speaker. Uh, he has delivered a session on uh, neural networks for regression. Okay, meanwhile, let me ask this question. Uh, does anyone out there on LinkedIn or on um, YouTube would want to talk live? You can ping me on Slack or probably you can uh, uh, put a message on. Uh, yeah, if possible, like, you know, you can uh, potentially uh, put a message on the chat on YouTube and uh, we'll be able to pick you up and like, you know, put you on the studio right there. Okay, I think Itlana should be able to help us with that. So with that, let me share uh, a message that we have from Pranjil. Okay, first of all, uh, he uh, congratulates everyone on finishing the boot camp. I hope all of you have learned something and enjoyed doing it. This boot camp is just the start. There is so much more that is out there and you will still uh, need to learn and so do I. Okay, it can be daunting and you will face a few challenges along the way, but you have taken the first steps towards something incredible. And I, and I want you to keep at it. Machine learning and AI is vast and revolutionary field with the capability and to impact loads of lives. And I hope you use this new found power to help and give back to the community and do something good with it. Teaching the skills, techniques, you learn to others will be beneficial to you as well. And it will help you improve your understanding of the subject in the process. Remember to keep practicing and improve your knowledge. Stay curious. Thanks. Uh, thanks a lot, uh, Pranjal, uh, for sharing such an insightful message. Uh, I totally aligned on uh, practicing and improving and iterating things over and over again. So yeah, thanks. Thanks a lot for such an, uh, an insightful message and being only present with us. And uh, with that, let me quickly go to the best notebook submissions, right? So uh, we have already listed all of them out here, wherein uh, I'll, I'll probably like you know, share this URL with all of you as well. And um, so in this particular uh, URL, you'll find all the notebooks. As you can see, these are the best notebooks, in no specific order. So once you click on this, you'll you'll see the complete repository of all the notebooks out here. Uh, and uh, yeah, just to read out, I think uh, coming to the best notebooks in the intermediate category are uh, 
जोस एरोजो निशांत नागराज गुरसिमर सिंह अहमद अलाम पिंकी चौधरी डैनियल जर्मन रूबिन सनी पाटिल मारियम बेलो जॉनसन क्वा शांतनिल क्रिस्टीना हाउले एलिशर अमांथे कार्तिक प्रतीक श्रीवास्तव आकाश बथेजा श्रीलता रेणुकुंटला जी ए वू ओके दिस ब्रिंग्स मी टू जी ए वू एज वेल आई मीन अगेन शी इज again like you know very very amazing and i think uh, she has been uh, sharing her experience probably i'll also uh, share her pulse article where she has captured all her 90 days of journey uh, she has an a very very amazing inspirational journey to share with the entire community i think i'll i'll probably put that up uh, out here it means every day counts she has set a goal target for herself and uh, uh, she has been able to i'm not sure if she will reach the goal or not but she has uh, definitely learned a lot from her experience and if someone wants to is curious and want to learn more about her interesting journey you can uh, uh, read the article out here it's it's truly inspirational and uh, the way she documented her learnings is very very amazing um with that uh, let me go to the beginners uh top notebooks as well uh, we have uh, tanmay choudhury uh, we have reza meena manogran diego we have deepa sarojan deeksha singh anushka drivedi these are the uh, people like you know whose uh, notebooks have been featured as uh, the best in the beginner category and uh, yeah i think uh, that's pretty much and uh, congratulations once again uh, to each and every one of you and before we sign off right so probably let me take you through the sessions that uh we have conducted and uh, probably like you know what we have learned out of this exercise one thing is uh, we have seen the power of uh, community learning if you ask me i think the content in terms of structure and other things you will also find a lot of free resources but uh, the most prominent part is uh, the power of community learning and also making it industry ready where uh, we have brought in some of the uh, best people in the industry who have been applying the same things at their work and uh, showing showing it to you hands on you see what you get so that that's the best part of the boot camp uh, so one thing is uh, the community learning where we are learning together struggling together growing together at the same time sharing knowledge together okay so this is the best part of uh, the entire boot camp exercise that uh, we have uh, realized and uh, apart from that um, let me check uh, quickly on uh, slack uh, and uh, yeah anyone wants to talk just wanted to learn from you guys okay uh, i'll i'll probably keep the tab open so that i know if if someone wants to talk uh, i can let you in to the studio and uh, one thing is what took everyone to do basically what made uh, uh, some of the learners achieve this is uh, passion to learn a new skill perseverance never give up attitude and believing in themselves i think uh, right at the start of the boot camp i have also shared uh, one of the inspiring uh, learning stories of uh, joanna uh, galino i hope uh, joanna is still there i'm not sure if uh, she is there on youtube or not but uh, she has shared a very inspiring journey as well where uh, uh, she spread this message think and feel that you can do it that's that's nothing but believing in yourself that you can do it and obviously the community is there to back you out uh, to back you and uh, make it happen so that's the thing which made things happen and the makers of the boot camp first of uh, speakers uh, it's dipanjan sarkar raviraj joinal ahmed uh, pranjala shwani sai gayatri vadali deeksha sabra these are the people these are the amazing speakers who made things happen and uh, these are some of the sessions that they have delivered for us um uh, and uh coming to the contributors um we have julian miranda uh and we have gunika batra manish farsana hasanali 
we have Banu Prakash Reddy. These people have been at the uh, Baganam, and I think uh, some of them were responding to your queries on uh, uh, Slack. Uh, but uh, yeah, I think they have done an amazing job in terms of putting up the content out there. And uh, most importantly, all the learners, okay, amazing learners out there. I think uh, you you have made things happen. Obviously, like you know, it's it's meant for you, and uh, without you, obviously, like you know, uh, we wouldn't be. Uh, able to see the things that are happening out there. And thanks, thanks a lot uh, for being such an amazing, amazing audience and learners out there. Uh, thanks, you keep motivating us. And um, of course, I mean, like uh, <laughs> the team behind it, we have, uh, I'm, I'm very proud of the team that we have. And uh, they, they struggle a lot. They do a lot of things at the back end and uh, uh, make things look good whenever I talk. So uh, thanks, thanks a ton uh, for each one of them. Uh, to begin with, we have Arib, uh, who is the web developer. Itlana, who is uh, on call with me. Uh, he, is, uh, he is trying to moderate out there on uh, YouTube. And uh, and also, like, you know, he's our co new community manager. And uh, the amazing posts that you are seeing on Instagram and on LinkedIn, uh, he's the one like you know who's putting it up and uh, coming to the features right uh, we have built some features like uh, the new features i'm not sure if you guys have seen it or not we have uh, uh, built an upload feature upload csv feature for the prediction file so you no longer need to uh, submit predictions in the form of a list so that was built by arib and uh, i think like you know he has built some other cool features out there thanks thanks a ton uh, to arib and Atlana. And we have a new entrant as well, uh, Gaurav. Uh, so uh, he's he's also working on a bunch of things and uh, soon we will see some amazing stuff from him. And we have uh, Julian Miranda. I think uh, I don't really need to give a special introduction about him. So uh, you know him, the community knows him well. Uh, same with Gunika Batra and same with Manish. Uh, also at the same time, I have uh, one interesting message to share from Manish. Uh, he's slightly shy and uh, uh, he never comes on video, but uh, he has a sweet message for us to share. This is this message is on behalf of Manish. It is good to learn from uh, inspiring journeys of learners across the globe. I'm pleased to interact with you all and uh, looking forward to making a difference together. This is just the beginning. Continue to learn and inspire. Thanks everyone for the amazing journey. This is the message that we have from Manish. Uh, thanks a lot, Manish, uh, for the message. And also, like, you know, he keeps saying that, like, you know, he keeps uh, seeing uh, different posts on Slack and on LinkedIn and a bunch of other channels um, for, like, you know, basically he keeps learning the stories and all, and uh, he feels good about it. And not just him, everyone out there in the team and also the coaches, as uh, Joinal mentioned, the speakers, everyone enjoys hearing the stories. And I'm sure, like, you know, in the process of sharing these stories, right, uh, I'm sure someone else who is reading your story would also get inspired. And uh, thanks, thanks a ton uh, uh, for each and every one. Congratulations. And uh, to the new beginning. And uh, yeah, for everyone to uh, continue learning and doing some amazing work out there. Thanks, thanks a ton, everyone, uh, for joining in. And uh, keep learning.